Jeremy Corbyn and his communist supporters are having a meltdown this evening, as the motion to take him back into the Labour Party massively fails. Fortunately, I have lost my tiny, tiny violin, but we are all sad for the godfather of modern Marxism in this country. The motion calling for the whip to be restored to Jeremy Corbyn is defeated at the top of the Labour Party. I'm not really sure why they're even obsessed with this new thing that he, he wants to start a new political party anyway. Why do you want to go back into Labour? I don't know. Jeremy Corbyn just tweeted about, well, an hour ago, uh, saying, uh, well, time of me report recording this, that uh, today's NEC vote and Keir Starmer's ongoing decision to bar me from sitting as a Labour MP is disappointing. I'm grateful for and humbled by the support I've received, especially from my Islington North constituents, aka all the hippies who don't really shower. Uh, and uh, yeah, their struggle for peace, justice, and sustainability. What? Well, well, firstly, Oxford, comma, you forgot. Secondly, why are you obsessed? Because you could start a new party anyway. Be mainly because you just used your keywords at the new political party, which got peace and justice political party, whatever it's called. You just used them. <laughs> your soundbite is there. Why do you want to be a Labour MP? Now, let's have a look at some of his supporters who are having a very, very tough time this evening. First, let's go to this one. Iris Mansi, who literally has a flag of Palestine <laughs> and hashtag Starmer out. You have a Palestinian flag in your bio. We know exactly what you what you mean and what your ideology is. So don't talk about peace. And uh, what was the other one? Justice. <laughs> when you're when you're supporting that side. So they're not happy. Personally, I cannot wait to see you win as an independent in May, and the labor the labor opponent losing their tickets. You've given Labour a good chunk of your life, and they don't deserve you now. Oh no. So sad, so sad. Next one, William. This guy, again, didn't read the memo, William. You have an EU flag emoji. Jeremy Corbyn is a Brexiteer. He's a secret lever. He was always a Brexiteer. He just couldn't really say, because he's the guy who you thought, you, you, all your commies voted for because he said, well, the one good thing he has is integrity and leadership and his conviction. Well, he sold them out to become leader. He pretended to be a Remainer. Uh, so those of you with EU emojis in your bios, mm -mm, he's not on your side. But William says, solidarity, Jeremy. They would rather invite Tories into their party than, res than restore the whip to a socialist. That's a good point. But <laughs> Next one. This one, the old git. You have a the rainbow flag in your bio. Jeremy Corbyn supports... Che Guevara, che Guevara, che Guevara <laughs> and Palestine. These two, specifically these two groups. Do you know what they do to the rainbow flag? Do you know what they've done in Cuba to the LGBT community? And he also supports Iran. You know what they do to the LGBT community in Iran? <laughs> I don't know why I'm going high pitched now because the old git is very, very sad. Angry face emoji. Words fail me. I'm glad. We well, got one like. One like for his tweet, so well done. Go on, Team Commie. So, every single one of you, also next to the EU flag emoji, it's got some sort of bike. That bike seems to be very, very against the environment. Sustainability. He just said sustainability. Be pro environment, guys. Be sustainable. <laughs> right, I'm done. <laughs> I, I, there were a lot of tweets. I wanted to kind of do a reaction to all the tweets, but if you want me to do it, just leave a comment section. I'll do it daily reaction to all the commie tweets that we see and all the nonsensical stuff uh, but thanks you guys for watching on my tz subscribe to the channel we and also actually before we go uh, tomorrow we're supposed to be having this uh, manchester tour uh, the the 2c tour that we're going to start uh, that's uh, i'm going to give you the details tomorrow but it's postponed till i think next week so uh, i'll give you all the details there tomorrow in terms of the venue location time and everything else but we're coming to manchester very very soon thanks again for watching i'm my tc and we are the media